My name is Todd Hendricks, and I am a sound designer and composer. My work uh, usually involves working in theater, sometimes on plays, sometimes on musicals. I had conversations with uh, Mr. Kohler, the director, and uh, you know they kind of revolved around what world he wanted to create for the play. Um, those kinds of things involve, you know, the time period involves uh, how much of the world is fantasy or reality. For a play like Midsummer Night's Dream, there's an interesting blend of realistic instruments as well as fantastical elements. Lots of times with uh, plays you sometimes want the music to seem really either really present or sometimes part of the world of the play. Some of the research I did, you know, consisted of uh, looking at some of the textures we wanted uh, the world of the play to have. Um, a lot of the discussions that uh, Mr. Kohler and I had um, had to do with uh, kind of having uh, percussive elements for um, the world of the fairies and as well as um, coming up with a period that was set in uh, somewhat of the Industrial Revolution. Related to that I you know did research into uh, lots of percussion elements as well as kind of more of a timeless style of music as well since you don't necessarily represent reality in this world. Um, so uh, there was kind of an effort to find very early types of music. The audience will usually have some sort of connection that they bring with them to whatever music they hear. So it's uh, very interesting to kind of create uh, some music that and resonate to the audience with, uh, with what you want them to hear, regardless of the instruments or the, uh, the tonality it has. So it's, uh, it's kind of a challenge to find a way to really reach the audience without having too many uh, preconceived ideas about what they're hearing. Shakespeare has so many things you can pull from it, has so many characters that bring things to light that you know there's always text people recognize when they hear the words that they've heard quoted or or in in other versions of it but uh, I think that I really like Shakespeare on stage because people walk away with more of ideas about um, the characters usually I find that the the characters and the 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 basic ideas about humanity are really something that are captured really well